In 4-H, 1890 Extension believes in the power of young people. 1890 Extension sees that every child has valuable strengths and real influence to improve the world around us. Thus, for Black History Month, the Charleston Cluster of 1890 Extension 4-H Youth Development partnered with Charleston Charter School for Math and Science for a 4-H field experience that focused on African American history with a Sights and Insights tour of Charleston, South Carolina. The 4-H field experience focusing on the Sights and Insights tour by Mr. Al Miller gave the students who are part of 4-H at Charleston Charter School for Math and Science a brief overview of their history and culture in Charleston, South Carolina, focusing on African American history. Being a part of the 4-H club, we like to expose the youth to different opportunities, and because this was Black History Month, we wanted them to understand the history of African American culture in Charleston, South Carolina. 4-H serves as America's largest youth development organization, empowering nearly six million young people across the U.S with the skills to lead for a lifetime. The Charleston Cluster 4-H field experience allowed seventh grade students enrolled in 4-H at Charleston Charter School for Math and Science to explore Charleston's ubiquitous African-American history and Gullah Geechee culture with Sights and Insights tour. Today we're very fortunate to go on a tour of historic Charleston. Um, in eighth grade, the students will learn about the uh, United States uh, history with an emphasis uh, on South Carolina history. Uh, it's very fortunate, as I said, it's African American History Month. Um, African American history is South Carolina history, and South Carolina history is African American history. Uh, we had the opportunity uh, to visit uh, Hampton Park, uh, go through downtown Charleston, see several of the beautiful homes in Charleston, and learn about their histories. Al Miller, owner of Sites and Insights Tour, brings 30 years of experience as a tour guide, and he is very involved in the city's black art and music community. During the tour, Al seamlessly blended authentic cultural expression with the retelling of events that shaped the modern day city. All right, now this city was settled in early April of 1670, and it was settled by the Englishman. And when it was settled, 93 passengers arrived here on a vessel called the Carolina. Of 93 passengers, we know that one black was on board and we believe that black came here from West Africa. The majority of the passengers were wealthy Englishmen. Others were indentured service and other Europeans. When that vessel landed, it did not land on this peninsula, this track of land that we're on this morning. It landed across the river at what we call today Charlestown Landing. The tour featured several historical landmarks. The 1890 Extension Charleston Cluster 4-H field experience exposed students to the Old James Island Plantation, Charleston Old City Jail, the historical aspect of Porgy and Bess, slave quarters on James Island and students walked on graves in which African Americans were buried. I learned about um, uh, like the um, first serial killer, uh, the first female serial killer in Charleston, and like the black community. I learned about that and several different churches and what about rice and stuff and how red rice is mainly eaten here. Thank you, South Carolina State, for giving me this opportunity to go on the tour. 1890 Extension's Charleston's 4-H Youth Development Programs reach depths that are unmatched. 4-H reaches kids in several parishes in Charleston County, from rural, urban neighborhoods to suburban schoolyards and the 4-H Service Learning Program. During the tour, the 4-H students were exposed to the east side of Charleston, the first public high school for African Americans in Charleston, Burke High School, Old Jenkins Farm, and Old Marine Hospital, and the Charleston City Market. I enjoyed it because it's like actually an opportunity to get to know more about where I'm actually from. And like, I really never knew nothing about those apartments when we passed by them. 
because I thought they were just apartments. I enjoyed how he was speaking to us and the terms that people speak then. He showed us the homes that were created. He told us the dates. And then he told us these stories that I never knew existed. As you can see, the 1890 extension Charleston Cluster 4-H field experience really provided the 4-H students with an exceptional educational opportunity. 1890 extension aims to bring vital, practical information to agricultural producers, small business owners, consumers, families, and young people. South Carolina State University and 1890 Research and Extension, transforming lives and inspiring greatness.